Henry Yakarundi, the innovator behind the innovative the entrepreneur from Rwanda. Le plaisir d'accueillir aujourd'hui Henri Nyakarundi. Pour en parler, l'équipage reçoit son concepteur, Monsieur Henri Nyakarundi. What's going on, world? Um, today I want to talk about why I don't believe in mentorship or having a mentor. Especially today's business, man. Things are moving so fast. I mean, I've done mentorship program. I've never had a personally a mentor. I can call a mentor. Um, except I, if I if I had to pick somebody, it would be my mother. She gave me the best advice early on early on in my life. So I, I may consider her as a mentor, but she's my mom first. So, but as far as mentorship or a mentor that you know, advise me, direct me, I never had one. That doesn't mean that you know. And I, and I hear mentorship a lot, man. I, I hear mentorship a lot, um, and I think traditionally that's where it comes from. You need somebody who can guide you and all that. I think that's the old school of doing you know business entrepreneurship, but. You know, I, I associate mentorship with advice. And uh, so before I start talking about why I don't believe in mentorship, let me tell you, if, you, if you're a startup or you're looking for a mentor, a mentor um, some of, the, some of the, the, the specific, what you should look, look for, basically. Number one, don't get struck by the fact that they more successful than you, right? A mentor, you need to find somebody in the field you're in. A lot of time we we look at entrepreneurs that are more successful and we want to reach out to be our mentor. But if they're not in your field, if you're in your agribusiness and they, they're in software business, they're not going to bring you much value. You need somebody in your space that has experience, that has achieved the success you're looking for, right? And then they can better guide you and understand what you're trying to do. So that's number one. You know, streamline and, and, and interview them. Make sure you, you look for the right mentor. Don't just pick somebody just because they're a successful entrepreneur thinking they're going to bring value. Uh, most likely they won't, you know. The second thing is when, you, um, when, when uh, you, you're picking or looking for a mentor is you need to know what you're looking for. You need to know your gaps. You need to know yourself, your weakness, which, you know, what advice. Don't don't just go, I, I get that often, oh, I need some help. What kind of help you look, you know, what, what kind of help you need? Oh, my business is not doing well. That's not specific enough. What area of, of your business is lacking? What, what, what some of the skill sets you lacking as an individual? And what are some of the skill sets you know, you, you, you're good at. You need to know yourself, your strength, your weakness. You know, you need to have a, a, um, a plan and find out where, where are part of the plan that are weak, so on and so forth. So you have an exact, you know, you can, you can exactly go and, and pinpoint those key points to the mentor and, um, and hopefully they'll give you value. Um, in some of those key areas. If you just go, you got a problem, you need help, most likely uh, they're just not going to be able to pinpoint where you need help on and they're just not going to be able to, uh, you know, to, to, to be of, uh, of support. And remember, mentors have limited time, man. They, if they're entrepreneurs, they have to run their own business. They got a lot of stuff to do. They're probably mentoring multiple businesses, um, you know, so that they don't, they're not going to have a time to sit down trying to figure out what the problem. Now, sometimes you do find a mentor that are patient and all, but they, they're very, very hard to get. A few years back, about four years ago, I, I joined a mentorship program. But again, I found out it was very general support. And today's business, you need specific help. Now, I want to talk about why I don't believe in mentorship, man. And the why is very simple. They don't have any skin in the game to really participate in your success, right? They don't have equity in your company. They, they're just giving you advice. Advice, well, you can get advice on YouTube today. You can get advice online. You don't really 
need a mentor to give you advice there's so much information out there that you don't really need a mentor you can google any industry and find an expert talking about it right i do the same and i do mentor and when i mentor a young entrepreneur i tell them the same thing some of the questions they ask please go on google and Google that stuff, man. You get information, take the information, test it on your business and all. There's no skin in the game. What you need is somebody that has skin in the game that can really bring you more than mentorship. You know, where you can tap into their network. A mentor will not necessarily share their network. Again, I'm not trying to say all oh, mentor I like that. No, that's not true. But a lot of them are like that. So um they don't have time and it's not their fault they got a job they got a business they got a lot of stuff going on and you asking them to be part of your team pretty much and that's not a mentor job an advisor that's a different or, or a board of director that's different they have skin in the game so they're more willing because now if they have even small equity in your company uh, now they, 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 they have an invested interest in making sure you're successful. So they're going to spend more time sharing more information, sharing their network, even participating in, in meetings and so on and so forth. So that's why I don't believe in mentorship. You know, I think it's more of a general approach. What you need is really somebody who can be part of the team. And that's more of an advisory or board of director. And they usually come in when you don't have a lot of capital, you can't hire them as consultant. So you bring them as an advisor or a board of director. Um, yeah, man. So I hope you like your content. If you do like it, and please share some comments, man. If 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 I'm sure there's you know mentors out there that do that go beyond you know giving just advice for nothing. And those men, I applaud them, man. I, I really do. I try to do that, but I'm not going to lie. I usually spend a lot more time spending in general advice because I just don't have time to sit down in team and all. But if I get equity in a company, absolutely. Um, you know, now I'm invested into that. I'll spend more time. And, and uh, you know, I'll be more motivated, if I should say, uh, to be part of the team.